Focusing now on your forecast this morning because it is still a nippy start to the day. Yeah, and we're also looking ahead here because there's some things that yeah. we need to be prepared yeah. for, especially if we're going to travel tomorrow morning. Yeah, it's going to be uh, kind of all day long tomorrow, but especially in the morning hours, we have snow and some rain showers that are sliding in. We have a first alert weather day now for Friday because of this rain snow building in the Friday morning, and we are expecting accumulations for the I-80 corridor. Travel in some areas up along I-80 and into the Laurel Highlands is going to be a little messy uh, because of the rain, the snow that we expect to see now. It's going to be mostly snow up along I-80. We have a freezing rain chance tomorrow morning, just very briefly, and then that changes over to some snow in places like Somerset County over into Bedford County, and then extending into the ridges. Two to four inches of snow possible there. If you're up in Venango County, Mercer County could see upwards of three to six inches of snow also coming in. Let's talk about your forecast and what's going on. This is at three o'clock tomorrow morning. You can see the rain shower starting to arrive at that point as it continues to move to the northeast and moves into that colder air. We'll start to see that change over to some snow and you see the other color, kind of that salmon -y color there. That's going to be that wintry mix that we'll be looking at, including some freezing rain chances for the ridges parts of Westmoreland County into Somerset County. It's all snow that we're expecting. This is at 8 o'clock for places like Butler up into Franklin, and that's where we could have that messy, slow commute first thing tomorrow morning. So I just want to let you know that that's going to be going on. More spotty showers late, and then as this cold front comes through uh, early on Saturday, we'll be looking at some light snow that will be around on Saturday. So temperatures on Saturday will be much colder. We'll probably be just into the mid to upper 30s. Might even see that uh, high temperature hit at midnight on Saturday with some really cold air rushing in behind that. 25 your temperature right now with the winds out of the northwest at six miles an hour. You can see these temperatures here. Indiana coming at 21, 25 in Pittsburgh, Zelianopel at 23, and Butler right there at 20 degrees this morning. A lot of sunshine expected today. Winds will still be fairly strong coming in out of the north at around 10 miles an hour this afternoon. That'll keep a little bit of a chill out there in the air. High temperatures should be near 50 degrees. I'm keeping Pittsburgh at 48, but you can see a couple of places out there will be in the 50s. Do want to quickly mention Sunday now into Monday. This is on 4 o'clock on Sunday. A wintry mix changing over to snow will be possible. Right now, even though this model is showing some decent snow for the Pittsburgh area, a lot of this is going to shift to the east, it looks like. We will still have a snow chance. We'll continue to monitor there. Could have a second first alert weather day being issued for Monday, but at least right now with just how early it is, I should say Sunday into Monday, we'll just keep those days not lit in that red color. 42 your Sunday high, 40 on Monday for your high. We're down in the 30s for highs both Tuesday and on Wednesday.